Oh yeah, so you plan on leaving me, huh? You're not ready to go. You need to realize that. I, I don't want you to leave too soon. Because if you pull out too soon, if you back away from me too soon, if you withdraw too soon, you're going to go through withdrawals. <clears throat> I don't want you to do that. When did you make that decision? How come you didn't let me know? This is something we could have talked about. You know, you probably listen to your friends, your mother, your aunt. They all single. How are you gonna listen to them and not listen to me? That just don't make no sense. The mother guys, they don't want you. They just wanna sleep with you. I'm the best thing you've ever had. All they wanna do is parade you around Show you off to their friends. How much time do they spend with you? Not much as not as much as I do. And you talking about you ready to leave me? For what? Explain to me what what made you think of that? Who helped you? Who influenced you to leave me? You're not even ready. All right, now I was in character. <clears throat> when a narcissistic starts to talk to you that way, narcissistic person, man or woman. They become very motivated. Now they want to talk because they are afraid. Like I tell you, they're afraid to lose. Now they want to reel you back in. Now they want to make you think. And in your mind, everything he's saying or everything she's saying, you start to believe. And we know that. You start to believe everything I say. And I'm getting closer to you. Now I'm more serious. Now I'm the person that you really wanted all the time. Now I'm the person that you really needed. But I wasn't doing that because I thought I had you. And right when you feel like you're slipping away, or right when I feel like you're slipping away, or when you really think that you're ready to go, I catch on, I understand, I feel it. Because when we do, even though we don't want, we don't put all of our time and effort into making you happy, being right for you, being with you, even though we don't do that, we have a sense of when you start to pull back. And a lot of times you all pull back too soon and we catch on. Then we start to become real motivated. And then so when we catch on, we become real motivated we start to make our, we start to get together our exit plan. And that's when you start to lose again. So when we start talking to you, first thing you do is your biggest mistake is you let your guard down. You're like, ah, am I ready to leave? Maybe he's right. And you start listening, you start thinking, you start rethinking, and you start doubting yourself. And that's when you lose. If you, start, if you, if you plan to, to pull away and to go and to exit, keep doing it. Regardless of how afraid you are, regardless of... If you start to feel withdrawals, because you're going to feel that. So be careful. Believe in what you believe in. Go with your gut feeling and keep going and don't look back.